It was 1945. The Second World War had just ended. And somewhere in a lab at Raytheon, Massachusetts, an engineer named Percy Spencer was about to change the world completely by accident. Percy wasn't your typical scientist. He never went to college. He taught himself electricity, physics, even calculus, all while working factory jobs. But what he did have was curiosity. One day, while testing a magnetron, a powerful vacuum tube used in radar, he felt something strange. His chocolate bar had melted in his pocket, but the air was cool. Now, most people would have just cleaned up the mess. Not Percy. He asked, what caused it? And more importantly, what else could it melt? He started experimenting, popcorn popped in seconds, eggs exploded from the inside, food cooked, not from heat, but from invisible waves. Soon, Percy built the first prototype, a bulky metal box powered by a magnetron. It was nearly six feet tall, and it could cook a sandwich in under a minute. His bosses at Raytheon were skeptical, cooking with radio waves. It sounded like science fiction until they tasted the results. In 1947, the first commercial microwave was released, the Rata Range. It weighed 750 pounds and cost more than a new car. But the idea? Revolutionary. Percy Spencer never patented his invention personally. He received a 2,000 bonus, the standard reward at Raytheon. But his spark of curiosity would go on to change kitchens forever. Today, more than 90% of American homes have a microwave oven. And it all started with a radar tube and a melted chocolate bar.